I wish this night routine went a little nicer. So, obviously tonight is one of those nights. It's a lot of staring into the abyss, getting lost in my head, and spontaneous crying. After a mental breakdown or two, I just kind of lay around to like, soak it all in. <laughs> you know, as if I need it to be any more soaked in. When I kind of get it together, I take my makeup off with a rose water wipe. I then move into the bathroom to use Mario Badeshu cleanser, another makeup and dirt remover, just in case, and then I moisturize with vitamin C oil. shower at night. I'm just not a morning showerer, and if you want that entire routine, I'll link it in my description for you to watch. Much like my shower routine, I get out and towel dry my hair. Tonight's a little different though. My hair was super greasy before I washed it, so I have to brush it because the knots are unbearable, whereas usually I wouldn't brush it until it's a little drier. Argon infused hair oil so my hair could get a little touch of freshness. The one thing that is different between my summer and fall routines is that I put Vaseline on everywhere. I literally put it on my lips, in between my fingers, sometimes on my eyebrows, literally anywhere that I feel could get cracked. was a little, you know, off, I decided to take out a positive thinking book just to get myself in the correct headspace. Usually I wouldn't do this, but considering I'm very like, usually a shower would calm me down and settle me into the night, but having a rough day. So we'll just read a little home thing and then we'll probably write so let me read something to you so it's not just like me Doo -doo -doo. 
All right. <sighs> Within you is the power to be positive. If you are distressed by anything external, the pain is not due to the thing itself, but to your own estimate of it. And this you have the power to revoke at any moment. Yawn. Again, this is a very, this is a very realistic end of night for me. Sadly, but maybe one day it will be like this and that's fine. At least I could tell myself that, but it's just, you know? On the plus side, I have this really pretty book, and I haven't written in it yet, so I wanted this book because it was so pretty, um, to be like a very positive, like, you got this, like, storytelling book, but I don't think that it's going to be that because it's just not realistic, but at night it's like, it all comes alive, all the demons come out, which is fine, like, I'm not complaining, I feel like I've made very close connection with them, but yeah, whatever, let's just, <laughs> whatever, enough of me explaining my actions, let's just get to my coziness and start writing. <laughs> After I write a little bit more, I'll probably just brush my teeth and go to bed. I don't really need to show you brushing my teeth because y'all know how to brush your teeth. I don't use any crazy toothpaste, I use Crest. Sometimes I charcoal, like I make my teeth white, but I usually do that in the mornings, to be honest. So if you want to stick around when I do a full morning routine, I don't know when I I'm gonna film that. I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know maybe, I hope it wasn't super depressing or anything. Don't think like every single night's like this. It's, some nights are, so I'm kind of glad. I started filming before I got in this predicament, but things happen. Life goes on with or without me, so. On that note, you guys know what I do in the night routine, plus side. Um, but yeah, if you guys like this video at any point, please give me a like, subscribe down below, and follow me over on Instagram. And I'll see you guys in the next vlogoween. Night!